Hell. More than just uh, notebooks, right? Backpacks. It's about your kids' health, and a lot of kids trying to get in to see that doctor this time of year. Exactly, and trust me, those appointments stack up quickly, they so do. it can be harder later on in the year to get those appointments. And in today's 19 for a Cure, our Dan Wells has more on your to-do health list ahead of the first day of class. Back to school season is in full swing, and the checklists are piling up. Notebooks, pencils, immunizations, you name it. This is super busy time because everyone's going back to school. So we need back to school physicals for everybody that plays sports. Um, daycares are redoing their forms. Um, so we're seeing all ages um, just to get their a lot of paperwork filled out and just for their well checks so they can get back into school and we know they're healthy headed back into the school year. Luckily, families can head to TriHealth Queen City Physicians in Madeira for top pediatric care. Really, we want to get them in. We want to do the routine care because we can get all the baseline vital signs when they're healthy. Um, and then that way, if something happens, we can see if there's a change in those numbers. And preventative wise, we want to give all the vaccines to prevent illness, disease, um, and do all the pre-testing that we can do for like autism screens and um, make sure they're meeting all their developmental milestones so we're not just always playing catch up if something's wrong. Shannon Miller is a registered nurse and says as classes start to pick back up, so do the cases of sickness that often seem to accompany back to school season. She also says there are ways to keep students protected and safe. Miller also says when you have long term history with your pediatrician, it allows him or her the opportunity to follow your child's progress and development over time. A lot of times they come in just because they need it for sports or sure. they need it for school, but it's really important to get those baseline vitals, weight, height, make sure we're growing appropriately. And then also, does the child have any concerns, especially when they start to get older? Are they getting nervous about school? Are they being bullied? Are they, you know, and sometimes it's a hard conversation to have and the doctor and the parent being there together can open up that dialogue for the child. Dan Wells, Fox 19 Now. Okay, Dan, thanks. More information on our website. Yes, you can go to our uh, fox19.com, obviously, and then from there, go to 19 for a Cure tab on our website again. It's pretty easy. Go. We make it quick and easy for you. We sure do. I'm hoping that we're going to be able to talk to this uh, woman. We're talking about kind of the myths of like laundry. I, and laundry. I know. Well, I want to like figure out how to do it. I still, I'm really bad at it. That's why you got Alice. Yes, I know. Your mom. <laughs> I, my mom. Thanks, mom. It's 10-12. We'll be right back.